It's Andrea from SWL, and I've been using a 10 meter long wire as my shortwave antenna, just clipped onto the whip like this. It works well, but it's a bit of a hassle all the time clipping on and off. So I also have this wire that I got with one of my radios. It's connected to a 3.5 millimeter mono plug. But as you can see, the wire is starting to get loose there. So I thought I would just cut this wire and connect my long wire to this plug. I also have this cable here that you can connect to the whip antenna and then it's got a little plug on the one side where you can plug in your 3.5 millimeter mono plug. So it's going to make my life a bit easier. This is my long wire and I'm just cutting it a little bit shorter and then the plan is to cut this wire but the little plug just fell off anyway so I'll have to try to bear the wire inside and I took a pair of scissors and I just started cutting here so that I can get to the little piece of wire on the inside. You have to be very, very careful here so that you don't cut that wire. It's very thin. So cutting, cutting slowly, slowly. And then I was able to expose a tiny bit of wire here. It took me a while and I had to cut really, really slowly. The idea here is just simply to connect these two because that's, it seems like that was how this wire was made anyway. It's just a string of wire connected to the plug. So I might as well just connect my long wire here. So I cut it a little bit more just to expose a bit more of that tiny bit of wire. And then when I got that, I used some insulation tape. So we take the insulation tape and we just connect the long wire, my 10 meter long wire, which is speaker wire, by the way, and it's outside the house. So I'm taking this insulation tape and then connecting the long wire to the 3.5 millimeter mono plug and then press it very, very tightly. You may need to make sure that that connection is very tight. Otherwise, the wire is just going to pull out the first time you pull it out of the radio. And then I use more insulation tape, quite a bit, just to make sure that it's got a very, very, very tight seal and tight fit. So that the long wire is now connected quite securely to the 3.5 millimeter mono plug, which, as I said at the beginning, was a random wire that was supplied with one of my radios. And then... Time to test. I will show you here FEBC, Far East Broadcasting Corporation, from Bokawe in the Philippines. And the difference is big. You can see when I'm using just the whip antenna, there's nothing. And when I plug in my wire, very, very good reception. Hal 